Welcome to Brew Review TV, where we are not too serious about seriously good beer. I am Hamp Tanner. I'm Ed Hall. That's the new guy. And today in the beer garden, it is... We've never had it, but we think it's going to be a delicious be, IPA from Firestone Walker. It's going to be a blockbuster. Called the Union Jack IPA. How about I tell us about this beer? Sure. Uh, Firestone Walker is located in California. In what town? Paso Robles. Paso Robles. Next. They're in the central coast. And uh, <clears throat> this beer was reviewed over at beeradvocate.com by 443 advocates. Not representative. Nope. And they gave it an average of an A minus. And the brothers at beeradvocate.com gave it an A. Not representative. Not representative. <laughs> ABV, 7.5%. Oh boy. That Decent? smells nice. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's see what else like about this beer? This beer appears on page 529 in the 1001 beers you got to have before death comes. Okay, I can get And more. Uh, that's it. Uh, Let's have a drink. Orange, yellowy, gold. Head white and the lacing. I'll tell you what, not much carbonation though. It's not bubbling from below. Got little bubbles, two little bubbles for the lacing. Mm. Mm. Almost dark white on that head, not quite, a little bit off white, but real thick. I like that quite a bit. Real thick. I haven't tasted it. You know me. Yeah. I like to ease into mm -hmm. it. You do. Mm. Mm. On the nose, there's a lot of malt. Just taste it. The guy is in a rush all the time. No patience. No patience. No patience. Mm. Mm. I'll tell you this. Beard, what do you got? Like it? No. Nah. Really good, really good citrusy, really good. really good citrusy flavor. Grapefruity. <clears throat> I like this. Grapefruity. Maybe like pink grapefruit, not not the gray kind, the pink kind. I think it's citrusy, flowery. You know what it reminds me of? Don't say it. Pliny? <laughs> Are you gonna say Pliny? With a little bit of malt added. A no. little, little bit, malt, tiny little malty, bit. A little malty, tiny maltier bit. than Pliny. Just yes. a pinch. You don't get the smell. <clears throat> you don't get that floral smell. True. Like on the Exit 4 or the Pliny. <clears throat> Exit 4 has also got a Belgian component to right, it. Right, but I don't even consider that anywhere near a Belgian. It's, that beer is almost like a Pliny. The floralness and the citrus of okay. it. Okay, take that argument <clears throat> to the beer experts. This doesn't I smell as good as it tastes to me. I'm gonna tell you what this smells like to me. It smells like Dogfish 90 I've been on the nose, doing but it doesn't taste like, like it that much. More flowery, citrusy than the 90. But on the nose. But when you, I'm when gonna you, say I'm gonna agree with a caveat. A little bit less maltiness yeah. on the nose than but, the 90. But when it when it hits the tongue, it is pretty all pretty much all citrusy. Yeah. Not with a little malt balance, but it's not. Not that malty on the taste. I know where I'm know. going. It's not that hoppy. I would like a little more. You're not loving it, are you? I would. I don't think it's the greatest thing in the world. Would you take it out on a date? No. Nobody go out on a date with him. No, I mean, this beer might, because this beer's inanimate. It wouldn't even know. It would not know. Want some more? No, no, no. No, those are two, you know I got Dr. Seuss. Those are two tonight. male animals on there. That'd Come on. Make you Nothing makes Dr. Seuss good. better than a good beer. No, your kids don't like it if you're just slurring. Mine do. Yours, yours are so used to it. If you spoke normal, they would know who they're talking to. <laughs> <laughs> I go home and I just give them a good old Dudley Moore from, what's that movie? Arthur. Arthur. <laughs> You gotta come up with a number, man. Right, That's what I got it's a about. number. I got a number for you. I know what you're gonna come up with. You have no idea. I do. I bet I, I do. I really do. Have okay, paper. jot it down on yours. Find out. I haven't written anything yet. You people are watching. You jot it down in pencil. What I'm gonna score it. Don't I'm not look. looking. Am I looking? I am listening though, so you better do it quietly. All right. Well, I think I know what he wrote.
Okay, I'm ready. You underscored it, dude. 91, he did. Yeah. Yeah. Go. 93. I gave it an 11. <laughs> well, that's what I had right here, 11. Wait, 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 I forgot to put this on the front. 91, people. That's a, you're 91. Three, you're way under. You give it a 93? 93, yeah. Wow, and you? you? 93. 92. We're all close. What'd you say? What'd you write down for me? 92? 93. 93. You wrote down 93? I thought you were going to hit 93. Damn. Mm. Really? I, yeah. I didn't rave about it. I think it. I do too. Feel? 93. <clears throat> nice. Wow. You know why? Why? Because I like the uh, citrus e, but not bitter. A little bit of a little bite, not much. Touch a bit of malt on it, but it reminds me of the Pliny with uh, <clears throat> if you took a little shot of malt and put it in there. All right, let me let, like now let bit. me tell you why I didn't score it as high, and I'll try to be brief. Please, <laughs> it's not as malty as something I like that's malty like the Dogfish Ninety, and it's not as citrusy as something that I like citrusy like Sculpin, Pliny. You know, it, it, and it, so it's kind of like in that in-between land where it's not quite carrying the day either way for me. Well, you talk it's about inconsistencies. Good, 91? Me, 91's a good he's beer. He's right. You, may, you know, you, you, remember his, you, you, you remember his comments on the Big Eye IPA? That it was pretty good. Now just let the viewers can go back and look at that. Yeah, and see, if back, any, see if there's any minutes. inconsistencies in that <laughs> comment versus the Big Eye IPA comments. I have the log. Anyway, anyway. He, he doesn't like me disagreeing with the 93. I, I mean, you know, could I be pulled up to a 92? Yes. Could I be pulled up to a 93? I think not. <laughs> How about a 90, 92 and a half? 92 tops. That's so wrong. Well, that's our show. Anyway. All right. Thanks for watching uh, Brew Review TV. And remember, drink hard. Drink fast. Drink often.